Hello. Today we'll be assembling our OptIR Touch Infrared Touchscreen Overlay 32A model segments option. Now this is an infrared touchscreen overlay, and the segments option specifically is shipped in four frame segments to allow for smaller packaging. Now this is a very easy kit to, to assemble, but you need to make sure that you have all the components ready before you get started. Now each of these segments should be labeled very clearly and have stickers with part numbers, with labels, and showing which part goes where. So you'll see the D part matches to the D part. The B part matches to the B. Now you can go ahead and lay out all the components and get ready to start putting everything together. Now be very sure to be careful of the pins because as you can see these are very small and they are very delicate. So be very very careful when you're putting everything together. Now Jovi's going to help me put all the pins together. And because this is fairly large you may want to have someone help you out. Let's simply slide the pieces together and then push to make sure that the pins are securely fastened. And then after making sure that all four pieces are joined, you can then begin with a Phillips head screwdriver to secure all the screws. Once you have the frame fully assembled, you can then insert a piece of tempered glass and secure it with the retaining clips included in your kit. Next, to install the hanging clips, leaving the bottom two screw holes open, you'll then get the segmented hanging clips and attach this, these clips relative to the width or depth of your display. These will then attach to your display relative to the height of where you might want that on your display. So if you have an especially wide bezel, you may want to put the hanger further up so that it hangs centered on the screen. You then secure the, the clips to each other and then to the frame. You can also put the touchscreen on the monitor first and then attach the back side of the hanging clips.
And after securing the touchscreen to the monitor, you'll then need to plug in the power cords, USB cords, and begin driver installation. These cords secure to the bottom left corner of the touchscreen. And you'll see a yellow light come on in next to the power cord. And this ends the installation and assembly of the segments option. You can now proceed with driver installation.